Hi, welcome to Stem Cell for Life. My name is Dr. Jane Hendricks and I'm the medical director. I'd like to spend a few moments talking to you about what to ask for when shopping for stem cell injections or IVs. First, you want to know where the stem cells are coming from. Second, you want to know how many you're getting. Third, you want to know how viable they are. There are three sources of stem cells. Bone marrow, these come from your hip. Adipose, these come from your fat tissue and umbilical cord. They come from the umbilical cord, um, mostly the Wharton's jelly. When thinking about getting stem cells from your body, we want to consider how old I am and am I under a disease state. The older that we get and the less healthy that we are, the less number of stem cells that we're able to get from our body and the less viable they are. There is no way that the physician who is pulling the tissue out of your body can know exactly how many stem cells they're going to be administering to you when it's coming from your bone marrow adipose. There's no guarantee on the number or the viability when getting it from your own body. So it makes sense if you're very young and you're very healthy. As we get older, anything beyond the age of 35, you want to think about getting stem cells from the third source, the umbilical cord stem cells. Why? They're youthful. They're only nine months old. And we can get a guarantee on the numbers. Which brings us to the second question you should ask. How many stem cells am I getting? A lab that is properly processing the umbilical cord tissue will be counting what's called colony forming units. These are the actual stem cells. If they are simply dividing up fluid and counting milliliters of fluid, this is not what your money is going towards. You want them to count the actual stem cells or colony forming units. So this is an important question to ask. The third question is how viable they are. There are certain cryopreservation methods that may reduce the viability of the stem cells in the processing. Our method in the lab that I use to get my stem cells leaves out a preservative called DMSO, which decreases the viability of stem cells. So our vi viability with the lab that I use has one of the highest in the market. So you want high numbers of stem cells. You want them to be young and youthful. After all, stem cell IVs and injections are anti-aging medicine, and you want them to be viable. For more information, please visit my website, stemcellforlife.com. Feel free to call the office for a complimentary consultation or come to my next seminar. Thank you, and I hope to be giving you a treatment soon.